What's going on everybody? Trevor here, and today we're going to start something new. I am going to try to write and record a song in the style of Fleet Foxes. That's right, I'm going to start a series of YouTube videos where I write and record a song in the style of various bands. If you like what you hear at any point along the way, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, and let me know down below what bands you'd like to see me imitate in the future. Google describes Fleet Foxes as neo-folk, and after listening through a bunch of their songs, I've noticed a number of elements that I'm going to have to reproduce to imitate them properly. First, the guitars and the bass. There's often a little noodly guitar part, followed by some strumming quick chords that bring the pace up. Then in the choruses or the bridge or when they're trying to add a little bit more character, they add some electric guitars for extra depth to the tone. And there's also a nice walking bass line that helps to push the progression forward. Next up are drums. This isn't a large rock band that hits the drums super hard and has a lot of punch. No, they're there mostly to keep the pace moving. And you notice that they're very often acoustic sounding, lots of floor toms and a nice round tone. Number three is vocals. The Fleet Foxes vocals often start with a big choiry church kind of sing-along part with a whole bunch of voices. Then, after building, the choir vocals give way to a single lead vocal that's very reverby. Then we'll go through and add harmonies to the main vocal until we come back in with the choir hook. Number four is feel. Most of Fleet Fox's songs have an upbeat kind of driving folk feel. I want to make it sound like we're in a gigantic church. And number five, the last thing we need to do is craft some lyrics. I find the vocals to be rather vague, as if we're going on a journey and we've forgotten something along the way or left our love behind. Perhaps a missed connection. So, without further ado, let's start crafting our song in the style of Fleet Foxes. So first thing I did was come up with just a little bit of something ahead of time, a nice little vibe that I want to go for. It's not exact yet, but it's going to sound something like... won't have quite such a strong resolution in the first part, but we'll see what happens as I start laying down the tracks. Check to make sure that the volume of the guitar is going to be right in Cubase here. So we play... Yeah, we want a nice fat volume there. Oh yeah, I think that's gonna work. I'm gonna need some headphones. So it looks like we'll set our tempo to 170. Why is it always harder the second time? <laughs> Apparently this type of music all sounds the same, but I think I made the song Kiss Me by accident. <laughs> Oops. No, that's not how it's gonna go. See? See, it goes somewhere different. Hmm, I feel like it should have just a bit of a minor twist in here, right? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, all right. Okay, so I've had an idea for one more little part. The chords are gonna move a little bit faster. Yes! <laughs> now can I do it again? <laughs> okay, so I think we have all three parts that we need, and I should probably just have a nice ring out, because I think the song's gonna end with that. So this is the hardest part of recording. Sometimes you gotta get this. All right, I think I have all of my strumming guitar. So what I want to do here is make an arrangement out of these guitars. I'm going to color each part a little differently so that I know which one is which. What I think we want to do is get the intro. That's nice. We're going to cut the intro in half and we're going to use it to do a re-intro in between the two verses. Then we're going to get to this one as the chorus. So that's a minute and 48 seconds. Drag this, we don't need that yet. Drop that in there. Then we're gonna get a chorus. What we wanna do this time is cut this chorus so that it doesn't have this double at the end. We wanna save that for the very end and do it like this. Bam, bam. I think we have a song arrangement. That's three minutes and 20 something seconds. Hmm, I don't know if I should go with the kiss me thing. Okay, so I went back, re-recorded the guitar, so that that last chord isn't the bright kiss me chord, and instead it's the minor chord. Okay, so I've got some words courtesy of my beautiful wife. It's just as vague and who knows what's going on as I hoped. Let's try it. First try, here we go. So far it's us just there Standing in the wilderness My feet cold and bare Stillness it follows us everywhere The confusion of time brings not What is mine? All right. I need a little more reverb on my voice. That's the problem. I just can't seem to get the first couple notes right. So far, it's us just this. So the next thing we're going to need is some harmonies. I'm just going to wing it and hope it turns out all right. Otherwise, I'll have to come back and do it better. Here we go. Let's try. So far, so far, so Okay, I gotta listen to it a few times to figure that out. So it's important when it comes to harmonies that I match the embouchure of all the words precisely. Even though I'm singing a higher note, I gotta make sure that my mouth matches. And also I take the breath in the right spot so that it is a perfect synchronized match. You're gonna see, I'll show you the recording and we'll see how close I am. So far it's us just there Standing in the wilderness My feet cold and bare It might be good enough for auto-tune. <laughs> I promise this is how it goes. So far So far it's us just there Today's Terrible Harmony and Falsetto is brought to you by Waterloo IPA. So far, it's us just there, standing in the wilderness, my feet cold and bare. Okay, so what we're going to do next is just get the little, oh, choir part at the beginning, because we got to make it sound huge, like it's a big choir. I'm going to even, even try to get my wife Antonia in here. Oh, 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 o
Okay, so this part's like the bridge. So me, I gotta give her, it's gotta be nice and high and punchy, like I'm really, really sad. But I got a wife and a baby and a life is great, but we're pretending we're the flea foxes. When all is said and done, the love has come and gone, and all that's left of you is memory, silhouette in the setting sun. But all that turned to rain, you left on the morning train, and all that's left for me is a feeling you're not coming back again. I think that couldn't have gone any better, yeah. We're definitely gonna need more harmony tracks. This is not enough tracks. Okay, so we're gonna start with the ridiculous falsetto first, cause you know. But all that turn of rain, you left on the morning train, and all that's left for me is a feeling you're not coming back again. Bah! Middle harmony. When all is said and done, the love has come and gone. And all that's left to you is memories in the wind and the setting sun. Yeah. So far, we've got all of the choiry O's and A's at the beginning. We've got a chorus, and we've got a big emotional bridge part that sort of functions as a double chorus. So all we need now are the verses. We're gonna go ahead and try to make this sound a little more churchy. Oh, there's a baby crying. Close the door. And we want, oh, a live wooden church. That's for sure, 100% what we want. Right? We want a live wooden church? Definitely. Definitely. Oh, 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 oh. Not sure if this church is big enough yet. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, more church, please. More echo. All right, we need a larger location. This wooden church is not big enough. Oh, a New York City church? Let's try A first. Oh, look at that church over here. Good church. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Is it slightly too much church? I think we got enough church, baby. All right. Okay, so I think I came up with a couple of verses. So it's about arriving and falling in love, having a great summer, and as it goes to fall, falling out of love, and then by winter, being kind of lonely. Exactly the kind of story arc we need. So. Oh, came to town, one-way ticket, left my home. I couldn't fix it, that's when I saw you. Standing and wearing blue You called me out Grand Central Station Fell in love in the factuation Took me out with you Most magical time I ever knew oh, 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 oh. Summer pass, now leaves are falling, drift apart, our love is stalling, what's I gotta do? How can I ever get over you? Now you've gone, I'm here with my phone in my hand, I'm waiting for your call that never comes, this cold winter my heart numbs. Like one note was a little funny, but I think I got it. All oh, right, so now we have our rhythm guitar and all of our vocals ready to go. So what I think I'm gonna do is end the first part of crafting this song right here. And I'm gonna leave you with what we have so far. I'm pretty happy with what we got. And next time we're going to add drums, bass, electric guitar, maybe some nylon guitar, and some strings, and some piano, and all the little things and touches that we need to really make it sparkle. And then we'll do a mix, and then finally at the end, I think we'll do a music video where I show all the little parts in clips cut to the song. I think that's gonna be super fun and a great way to have lots of content. So thanks everybody for watching, and I'll see you in part two. Oh, oh, oh.
is it that's when I saw you Standing there and wearing blue You called me out, Grand Central Station Fell in love, infatuation Took me out with you Most magical time I ever knew oh. Upon our love installing, what's a guy to do? How can I ever get over you? Now you've gone, I'm here with my phone in my hand. I'm waiting for your call that never comes. This cold winter, my heart numbs. So far, it's us just there, standing in the wilderness. My feet cold and bare. Stillness, it follows us everywhere. The confusion of time brings none. What is Try